look at this amazing trippy underwater view. <laughs> All right. Hey fellow survivors, it's Explorer Andrew here. Uh, today I'm going to be doing a kind of a guide video to show you where you can get red gems from the Aberration DLC, uh, the locations on the Ark Olympus map. The red gems are used for creating uh, different types of patterns like the charge lanterns, the rock drake saddle, uh, this fancy gas collector here, which I'll show off some more in a future video uh, as it's used for creating element. Uh, and some tech patterns kind of later on in the game. So, uh, But with today, we are going to show you several locations where you can get your hands on these beautiful bread gems. So whew, uh, let's jump to it, shall we? All right, survivors. For, so for our first location for getting yourself some red gems, I'm already in the aerial view. Uh, this island is kind of dangerous. It's very reminiscent of the Carno Island, I would say, from the island map. Uh, lots of different types of nasty dinos down here so do make sure that you come well prepared uh, good mount armor weapons all that good stuff but we are currently sitting down in the very bottom right corner of the map at 88 by 82.8 uh, looks like the Sun is about to go down on us here so beautiful little shot but yeah you can see on the map to the left there and what you're looking for is there is a couple of little spots right around here where you can get yourself some red gems. There you go. Uh, but like I said, Carno's already after me. Uh, there's a couple locations. There's one not too far away from here as well, too. There's not a ton of red gems here, but if you're down here hunting or trying to tame some of the, you know, there's Dinanicus down here, so some of the other uh, crazy creatures. There might be a Denonicus nest here to grab some eggs, I'm not too sure. Uh, but there are some other resources here like metal and whatnot, so, but a couple locations where you can get red gems. All right, survivors, so for our next gem cave, uh, we are going to be going underwater again, and we are currently sitting at around 85 by 7.4, and you can see on the left on the map there, my little icon indicator. Um, Forgive me, it is storming right now. But basically, we are sitting on the very south side of the Aberration Islands here. So um, this is another Aberration Cave. I really highly recommend coming in here with some form of a really good mount. Uh, even a Thyla uh, would be really good, a high-level Thyla. Um, you may want a scuba tank. It's not a very long cave to get to like the other one, but... Uh, but that's up to you. So basically you're out here in the water You're just gonna come straight down and you are looking for this little entrance right here Little outcropping of rocks sticking out once you find it It's just gonna be a very linear little path here. Like I said, it's very it's pretty quick You may not really need a uh, scuba tank like the other North aberration cave, but once you get in here, there is a lot of deadly creatures. There's uh, aberrant Arthopleras, there's a bunch of Carnos, but basically you just come through here and this cave opens up uh, like so. Uh, there's a lot of different kind of shorter jagged paths that you can take uh, to get through. Um, but basically you are just going to run around and you're looking for these little crystals right here. And so they are scattered randomly all throughout and just come up and harvest them. There's some over here. Uh, there is a fair amount or a few spots anyways down below where you can find some more that you can harvest. Uh, there's also gas nodes in here. Uh, but just like I said, bear in mind all the aberration dinos. There is even rock drakes in here. So just be careful. But yeah, this is where you another alternative place where you can come get red gems. Now on to our next spot. All right, survivors, next up on our gem caves is gonna be another red cave here. Uh, this one's not as bad to get to as the Aberration ones. It's fairly small. Uh, there's only a few sort of deadly creatures to it. It's pretty easy to get to, pretty, pretty easy to navigate. Uh, but what you were looking for is, we are currently sitting around 54.7 by 12.6. 
and you can see on the map to the left there where my little icon is uh, and we're just right down there so there's a giant opening this one's really hard to miss so but we're just on the uh, I guess kind of south side of the uh, snow biome so let's have a look shall we all right and so here's a aerial view for you from the front side of the cave uh, Mount Olympus over that way, snow biome behind us there with the blue obelisk. But basically you're just going to come down, like I said, uh, you're going to want to have uh, some type of decent weapons, uh, possibly even a good land mount. Uh, I cleared out a few of these guys, but yeah, you're looking at some snakes and arthropleras and scorpions, all that good stuff. So once you're here, just come on in. There is bats in here as well too, so be mindful of that as well. Uh, spiders, but yeah, you're just looking for these little clusters of the different red gems, and you're just going to come in. There's also crystal in here, but yeah, just come in, grab your red gems. There is also a explorer's note back here, tucked in a little corner there as well too, so be sure to grab that as well too. Unlock that and get yourself some uh, better, some some increased experience. So, But with that, that's going to be our next red gem cave. All right, survivors, so for this video, I've showed you guys several spots where you can get yourself some red gems, uh, a couple of cave locations, a, as well as a spot above ground that has a few nodes to it that you can get to. Uh, I'm gonna put up the coordinates for two more spots. I won't show them off. I'll leave that to you guys to be able to explore. Uh, this is, however, one of them where I'm doing my outro. Uh, I do highly recommend that you come in here with some very good armor. Uh, weapons and a very good mount because well as you can see from the top down it is a volcano there's lots of deadly creatures in here but there's a good amount of red gems in here as well too lots of reasons to come in here and explore it's it's a very cool location uh this one is at 80.6 by 37.1 it is the volcano uh, on the arc olympus map and one more spot for you guys to be able to check out it is another artifact cave it is at 23.8 latitude by 82.8 longitude and sits in the east side of the desert biome so uh with that you guys i hope that you all enjoyed this video where you can find yourself some red gems uh if you haven't checked it out i'll put it on the screen at the very end you can click on it and it is my where to find blue gems on the olympus map video uh but with that if you didn't find this one useful and enjoyable please drop a like down below i greatly appreciate it uh hope you guys all have an awesome day and hope to see you on the arc